Hello guys, welcome to Stereo Tech. So after we unbox the Nokia 3, that's a new mobile phone from Nokia. So this is how it will be now. So I've tried it, tested it, um, do something in it, um, you know, for £99, see how much, I mean, how worth it would be this Nokia 3. So this is the Nokia's most budget smartphone, so the screen itself is actually just 5 inches. It's not a high definition, but sort of like 720 by 1280 pixel. So from that, so it's not a bad looking phone. In terms of holding it, uh, I would say I haven't got big hand, but sort of like a manly hand, but yeah, I can definitely it's like a manageable I would say so it's not too bad in terms of the camera itself it has an 8 megapixel in front also have 8 megapixel on the back so it has that um, flash at the back of it so as you can see so here are the sample of the camera So as you can see, it's not the best camera that you can get for the £99 mobile phone. So yeah, you can expect that it has a little bit of greenish and thing like that. It has sort of like generic lens, as you can see, it's not, you know, it's not going to give you the best um, camera or picture ever, but it's not too bad if you are not into it. So if you have a proper mobile phone, okay. so. This mobile phone, this Nokia 3 actually got 16 gigabytes, which is not too bad uh, to put all your apps and things like that. But you can also put a micro SD card in it, so it's going to be here, and that is the, the same card slot. So it has 2 gig of RAM uh, to do your multitasking and open apps, at, you know, multitasking and more apps that you can open if you want to. In terms of the battery anyway, it's not too bad as well. It has 2630 milliamperes. It's not going to be over the top, but it's it's probably enough for you to survive from the from morning to afternoon with like, you know, simple use or not too much anything like that. Okay? So, the glass of this Nokia 3 itself, um yeah, mind you, that is a um, Corning Gorilla Glass from Nokia but yeah they didn't say what version is it but it is a Corey Corning Gorilla Glass so the look of it is actually looks like the old Nokia Lumia which is really really square as you can see so I had the Nokia Lumia looks exactly like this so they recreated that too Okay, so aside from the Corning Gorilla Glass of this mobile phone, the, the side of it is actually aluminium, so that blue is actually aluminium, so which is a little, you know, which is tougher, I would say, like what the iPhone has, so that is aluminium. So, it's a great feeling, like when you hold it, it's, it doesn't feel really cheap, if you know what I mean, but it is cheap, yeah. Okay, so it's not actually not a bad looking phone, but there is one thing I, I, I mean, missing on this mobile phone. It hasn't got that option to light up the navigation keys on the bottom. So if you are, you know, if you use your mobile phone at night, there is no way that you will, you know, you will see that navigation key unless you know where they are so basically you have to familiarize yourself so you have the back button home button and the uh, opening all your apps in there so sort of like um, yeah you have to familiarize yourself in it so mostly you will see the um, you will see the settings on the display here um, and then the navigation keys there is no option to put the navigation key on there but aside from that, it's, to, it's actually alright if you're going to use it with light so you can see what you are pressing. But if you are, if you use this probably one or two weeks, you will probably be familiarized or 
familiar with the, the button you are pressing at the bottom. So you just need to be very careful and be aware of that. So that is the one missing from that. So I'm gonna show you the speed of this mobile phone as well. So just gonna test the uh, the speed, the graphics, the, the processor. Let's see what score it will have, all right? So I am now literally testing it. Um, to give you an idea for the sound quality of it, the sound quality isn't too bad at all. So as you, as you can hear that, that one. But if you look on the graphics itself, you can see that it's really laggy, it's really, you know, sort of like sticky and thing like that. So just gonna wait for that to finish and I'm gonna tell you the score of it and we will compare it to one of the basic mobile phone, probably the Samsung A3, I'll show that to you. Okay, so yeah. Okay, so after the testing the Antutu benchmark, so that's gonna be the total score of this mobile phone, so Nokia 3, and it has a 26,754. And while I'm doing this, actually, I have tested the uh, the Samsung A3 2017 model as well to give you an idea how you know the performance will you know differ different from the other mobile phone. So that's a 26,000, and you have 34,400 for the Samsung Galaxy A3 2017. So both will have no, um, Android Nougat, so 7.0 or 7.1 or something like that. But both of them are Nougat version. So that's gonna be the speed of this Nokia 3. So, okay, so that's gonna be it. Um, so the Nokia 3 is actually not a bad phone for someone who likes just doing some social media, um, email, internet, phone, message and call and something like that so nothing really fancy but if you want to like um, play games at it, yeah you can play games I'm gonna show you um, like for example if we will run a heavy game like okay so we're just gonna try this game here um, as you can see like when you open something there is really latency before you before I mean if you press something and like if we can open that okay how is it yeah so it's not too bad I mean you can play games don't get me wrong but it's just like it's just really slow and there is some latency in it so and I can feel it's getting a little bit warm while I'm playing. Um, yeah. But it's not too bad. Yeah, you can play games in it. Okay. So, alright. So that's going to be the Nokia 3. Um, if you have any question about this Nokia 3, yeah, give me a shout. Um, don't forget to put that in the comment section below if you want to. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you uh, haven't subscribed to my channel or if you haven't subscribed to my channel okay so thank you for watching guys and hopefully you get something or you learn something from me from this Nokia 3 and yeah thank you for watching bye bye